Hey guys, what's up? It's I Can Fly Jake, and today we are back with a series I have not done in a long time. Um, basically, ever since Daisy has hit 0.63, I just haven't really done it, and that is Loot in 10 Minutes Challenge. And I'm going back to my roots. I want to do one of my favorite cities for doing this in, and that is Berezino. Now, we're going to be doing mostly the lower part of the city here, but basically the challenge is I have 10 minutes to get as much loot as I can from the kind of places I think the best loot will be um, on a server that's medium to high pop, which is exactly what this is. Um, and we're just going to see what we can find just to show you guys what kind of loot you can acquire in 10 minutes. My character is thirsty, so at some point we'll probably have to get some water, um, but hopefully that doesn't hinder us. Anyways, guys, I'll start the timer in just a minute, and we're going to run through the city and see what kind of stuff we come out with. Alright, so starting the timer now. Let's see, go ahead here. Okay, got ourselves a hatchet. That's good. We can go ahead and open food with that. Sneakers. Don't really need sneakers for anything. Um, I'm sorry if you hear keyboard clicks in this recording. I mean, you're just going to have to considering, well, I'm playing with a keyboard and mouse live instead of a post commentary. Uh, we're going to drop the flare. Nice find of peaches. So we have food and a weapon. That's a very good start. Um, now, I, I kind of picked this part of the city because obviously we're not going to have time to loot the entire city. Um, so, yeah. Let's see what we got here. Oh my gosh. Okay, FNX and binoculars. Can we even carry those? Oh crap, I don't actually know. Um, okay, we got that. Okay, binoculars, I guess you'll have to stay. We don't, ha don't have room for the binoculars. Okay, that's fine. Uh, oh wait. Um, let's take this jacket. I actually think it looks a little bit cooler. I know that probably isn't worth our time right now, but style, hey, style is a little bit important. You have to, you have to admit. There's a chicken over there. We're gonna ignore it, obviously. This is, uh, had nothing to do with chickens. Um, limited time. Gosh, okay, so, so let's open this. Anything good in here? Oh, USG? That's a decent find for sure. No magazine with it, but I mean, hey, definitely worth finding because, of course, later in our travels, we can always come across a magazine. Already starting off very, very well. Um, a wrench? Don't need that at all. Enduro helmet? A heck, why not, right? Actually, it's reducing our it's it's reducing how long we can sprint. I forgot to mention this is a normal server too. This is not any kind of server where they're spawning extra loot or anything. This is the kind of servers you guys are playing on if you're on the public servers on either Xbox or PC. Um, so this kind of is a good idea for anybody. I hear a zombie, and I'd rather not get involved with him. Um, that's just gonna waste more time. So five. So I've got till basically uh, eight forty-five. All right. I was trying to glance over the time. Don't want to get any zombies looking at us. Um, let's check these train cars, though. They have good loot often. Um, Epox Putty. I actually don't even know what you use that for. I'm guessing it relates to cars, maybe. Hiking pants. Don't need that. Don't need anything over there. These train cars used to be really good back in the day. Um, ooh, a sledgehammer. Let's grab the sledgehammer, actually, because... Um, yeah, let's keep the sledgehammer. Let's do that. Alright, I think we're going to have to kill a zombie here, guys, because i got to get over this direction, and he's in my way. A little tip, guys, I, I like to sp sp spark out a few tips here and there in the middle of these videos, too. Always take the initiative with zombies. I have a video giving a tutorial on how to deal with them, um, but one, first things first is to always be the thing that hits the zombie first. Oh, let's grab a bandana, right? Why not? Uh, anything else good in here? Nope, nope, nope. Alright, let's get into the city. We've got a police station up here. I don't predict the police station to have anything too good, honestly. Um, there's a car battery. I think we've attracted a zombie. I just heard a screaming. Um, but since it's already seen me, we're just gonna wait for it to come to me. Alright, here it comes. Dang it! You're wasting our time, zombie! We're gonna see how much loot we can get in ten minutes, and you're here screwing us up! Alright, got her down. Got her down. Any, any food on you? Nope. Always check zombies, guys. Often they have food. Crap, we are really low on thirst. That's also gonna waste some time here. Um, anything good here? No. Um, we're gonna hold off on getting a drink. Normally I would say hurry as fast as you can to get a drink, but we are in a rush to loot. Um, we're gonna hold off and we're gonna go ahead and first go to the police station. Oh, is that a gun? Oh, baby. Okay, I'm gonna prioritize the shotgun for now. If I can? Yeah. Because I think it's more likely we find shotgun rounds than SG-45 rounds, but to be fair, we could've, like, if we had a big enough backpack, we could've kept both. So it's really good to know what kind of loot we've already found. Gotta take this guy out so he doesn't bother me inside the police station. Alright, good, good deal, good deal. Any loot on you? Nope. Okay. Hopefully nobody else is in here. That would that would really throw a loop in the program. Um, anything good? I'm telling you, the Berezino police station has got to be one of the worst places for loot. Um, I never find anything good in here. Maybe if I talk negative about it enough, it'll uh, it'll produce something good if I talk bad enough. Ooh, 
that's actually handy. That'll give us a little bit more storage. Um, so always swap to bigger pants um, or bigger clothing. Um, that gives you more storage, uh, especially if you need a backpack. Like if you don't have a backpack yet, you need the storage. Now if you have a backpack, it's not always worth it because the clothing might weigh more. So anyways, just a little consideration. Police pants, normally I would swap those because they're in better condition, um, but we don't got time. Oh, we'll take some handcuffs. Why not, right? Why not? Um, man, we've got to get some water, though. Um, let's hurry over here to the water fountain. I believe we have about four minutes left, five minutes left. All right, here we go, water fountain time. I'm just going to get enough slips, slurps to not be dying. I do not need to be worrying about... Oh my gosh, come on, the skate helmet is messing me up. Seriously. All right. Three, I get two more, two, actually we'll get three more. <laughs> this is ridiculous, I can't believe I have to waste time with this, but I guess, I guess that's what you go through, and Daisy's survival here. And one more, one more, one more. Alright, got it, sorry, you guys probably heard me spamming my keyboard there. Now, I want to go and check, um, man, the other side of the city often has good stuff. I would like to find some more food, I think that's pretty crucial too, nothing good in there. These things often have decent loot, um, so I'd say they're worth checking. There we go, 380 rounds. Very good find. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Alright, so let's check these guys. I really don't want to get any more zombies on me. They waste a lot of time. Um, how about this? Anything good in here? Like I said, these things have good loot. Look at that. Look at all those loot spawns in there. Nothing good, but it's, it's good for you guys to know that's a good place to check. Often food. There's a hoodie. You can cut those up, get some rags. Um, worth checking this? Probably not. There could be something. Oh, look at that can opener. Yep. Check. Hey, guys, always check pants, too, or clothing. Like, check to see if there's anything inside it. It's always worth it. Um, there's a fire station over there. I'm trying to remember if there's any more, um... Holy crap! Where did she come from? Oh, my gosh. Well, speak about wasting time. Let's kill this zombie. All right, it's dead. That scared the crap out of me. Okay, we don't have a ton of time left, but there's going... I want to check the, uh... You know what, we're going to... Yeah, we'll keep the hatchet. I want to check these green sheds over here, because they often spawn, like, police-level loot. Um, let's shut this gate behind me. Should be... There it is, right there. We got about two minutes left, it looks like. We're hungry, it's okay, though. We got food, a little bit anyways. And we're near some water fountains in this city, so it's alright as well. Crap, nothing too good in there. Nothing too good... Let's check the police or the uh, the fire station. It might be our last stop. Oh crap! We gotta kill the firemen. Man, all these hits are wanting to be heavy hits. There we go. All right, that, I'm telling you guys, the hatchet though is also a very good weapon. Um, oh man, there's nothing in here. Not turning out too well. Not turning out too well yet. What is this? Nope, nothing. Is there anything in this fire station? Our last looting place. We're not gonna find anything. We gotta find something in here. We gotta find something in here. Nothing. Nothing in the fire station. Alright, we're gonna finish off with like one last building. Um, in fact, I'm just gonna. Can I, can I like slide off this thing? No. We're gonna, we gotta take the stairs. Whatever. One last building. I know our time is probably running out here, um, but I wanna check like one last couple houses. I know I said one and then I'm like last couple, but I figure it's fair. Fair game. Medical building? Eh. I don't think it's worth it. I don't think the medical building is worth checking, honestly, right now. We're, we're in a tight situation with the amount of time we have. Um, and I don't want to waste it on that. Oh, what do we got there? Battery. Don't really need a battery. I guess we could grab it, right? Why not? We got the, we got the storage for now. I was wishing we'd find a backpack, because it's a really good sign of uh, a fair amount of looting. Another battery. Don't really think we need two batteries. I think we got a zombie on us. I, I hear one growling over there. And we're going to finish off... With our last building, guys, let's check one last building. What do I want to check? The green building. These these houses are pretty decent, and it'll be the last one we check. Our time might be up here in a second. Um, it might be up already, but I figure let's finish off with this. Quilted jackets. Hey! What a way to finish it off. Five shotgun shells. That is insane. What are the odds of that? I, I am astounded. So what, what a perfect way to end this off. Loading up our shotgun with some five shotgun shells. We're ready to go, guys. We have ourselves a way of cutting open food. We have a loaded gun. Um, we have a little bit of food, actually, to go ahead and eat as well here. And we have a pistol, um, along with some. We could have cut up some more rags and stuff to be more medically sound. In fact, we probably, if we prioritized our loot better, we probably could have got to the medical building and got some decent stuff. 
Um, but in the end, guys, we ended up with some pretty good loot. We got ourselves a can of peaches, a shotgun with ammo, a box of 380 auto or 380 ACP rounds, an FNX 45, handcuffs, 9 volt battery, 4 rags, and a can opener, along with a hatchet too, actually. So pretty good find, I'd say, for 10 minutes of looting. I mean, that's like I'd be pretty satisfied that with that if that's what I walked out of Berezina with. Honestly, I'm satisfied if I came out of a town with any loaded gun. Well, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like on the video. Each like means so much, and it really just shows me that you want to see more of this stuff. So if you're one of the few hundred people still watching by the end of the video, first off, I appreciate you anyways. Um, but I really extra appreciate you if you drop a like. Uh, leave any comments with anything you want to discuss. I read every single comment. And subscribe for more Daisy content. I hope to see all of you guys in my next video.